tonight at 5.30, three people who were supposed to take care of a five-year-old girl are tonight accused of torturing her, leading to her death. Investigators say that Kinsley Welty died of malnourishment, and today her mom, her mom's boyfriend, and her grandmother all face a judge in the case for the very first time. Our Rich and I was in court today with his camera rolling when they talked to the judge. You are here for your initial hearing. I'm here to tell you what the state has charged you with. 29-year-old Tony McClure is charged with the murder of her five-year-old daughter, Kinsley Welty. The prosecutor says the little girl died of malnourishment, confined to a closet, blocked with a baby gate and dresser. The prosecutor is seeking a life without parole sentence for McClure. Judge Mark Stoner assigned her a public defender. Do you support anyone beside yourself? Okay, and how many? Five. McClure did not clarify if that five includes Kinsley. The prosecutor believes others are also responsible for the child's neglect. McClure's boyfriend, Ryan Smith, is charged with neglect of a dependent resulting in death. Okay, are you planning on hiring counsel or you're requesting a public defender? Um. Done it yet once, sir. Okay, but you haven't done so yet? No. Smith is free on bond. McClure stays in jail while they both await trials scheduled for June 24th. But still more people are being charged in Kinsley's death. Her grandmother, who is McClure's mother, Tammy Halsey, also appeared in court Tuesday. The judge delayed Halsey's initial hearing until Thursday morning while the prosecutor decided on formal charges and asked that the case remain sealed. The matter is still under investigation. Um, I believe they're still um, investigating other people who are, may be involved in this matter and they still intend to um, make further arrest in this matter. Court records could soon reveal how a little girl who was already in the DCS system could be treated so poorly for so long. At the Marion County Community Justice Campus, Rich Nye, 13 News.